Great United was involved, uh, established in 2012. Uh, we wanted to have a true community club. Uh, we are the Pan Disability Club for Inverclyde. And Michael from the advisory group asked us if we could start up a team for adults. Uh, we went and spoke to Michael. Michael was very enthusiastic about it. So we took everything on board and July 2015 started the adults disability section and in such a short space of time we went from Inverclyde to the National League you know what I mean it's, it's, it's been great within within a few short months you know what I mean we've got we've got a, a team from Greenock in the National League which is fantastic you know what I mean absolutely first class you know what I mean uh, and it, it really has grown from strength to strength we do try and have uh, different things with the, 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 the club as we, 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 we try and involve the guys in just different bits and pieces of the community. There's, there's Wiggy, I just spoke to Wiggy over there, Robert Wiggum, and, and, and he was he was pointing to his badge and he's pointing to my badge and I says, yeah, that's right, Wiggy, we're the part of the same club. We are Greater United, you know what I mean? And, that, and uh, that's what it's all about, you know what I mean? It's just putting a strip on and putting a badge on, you know what I mean? And, and get going, you know what I mean? Aye. We're not we're not employed by them, we're not social workers, we're not we're not careers advisors. We're just their mates. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Right. Sure it is. When is it in a Monday you start doing what after your shows what you do? Uh, start kicking your feet, don't you? He just loves coming to the football. I'm sure you do. Uh, fair makes your year. He loves it. And a Wednesday. Yes, we take you down, don't we? Yes, and I drop them off, and I don't know what to do without this because he really loves it. So you do. Uh huh. Looks forward to it from a, win a Wednesday it is to the following Wednesday, and it's great exercise and everything for him. Uh, Hi, uh, my my name is Mark uh, Robertson. I live in Greenock. I play for Greenock United. What, what, you've got a particular role in the football team. What, yeah, what position yeah. do you play? I, I play goalkeeper. I just, I just, I just, I just like coming and playing for them on a Wednesday night and getting to see all the people. What, you made some pals? Uh huh. Jordan, yeah. Side, so, so, what's been good about that? Have you gone anywhere else, somewhere else? Yeah, we went to. We, we went to. Uh, thingy. We went to Forrester's High, high School. And Edinburgh. And Edinburgh. And we, we, it was good. I enjoyed it. Yeah, I've made. I've met a few people that are well that I know already, but a few faces I don't. And you were telling me earlier on that you you got somebody else involved in it. Mm -hmm. From from there, he was in school with me, and um, he was in he's in college with me. And did you just say to him? That I just said to him that there's a team starting, and then he just said, um, <laughs> eh, "Well, can you put my name down for it?" Nothing. Oh, sure, sure. We were a good coach. We were a good team. We were part of our team. We were part of our family. And that's it. I think it's, it's, it's generally a, a success story Michael's brought to to the area. It really is. You know what I mean? We see we, we started off. We only had maybe five or six players, but twenty coming regular now. Yeah, and then we've got people wanting to come. You know what I mean? Which is great. Mm. You know what I mean? And, and they're turning up, rain, hail or shine, on a Wednesday night for, for training, which is great, you know what I mean? Would you like about it, Matthew? Would you like about it? Playing, don't you? Yes, he loves to play in the football. And you tell your brothers, your brother and your sisters and that, don't you, about it? And your granny and your mum, your sister, uh-huh. Aye, and your gran, and your brother, and your aunties and uncles, uh-huh. And he just loves it. I can't even say any more than that. Oh, happy. Uh huh. To make you happy, Matthew. Uh huh. To make you happy,